everybody. Welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Mike's Likes. I'm Mike. This is what I like. Today, we are continuing our Pokemon card collecting journey. Yeah, that's what they call it. Battle Styles. Oh! That's Tyranitar. Okay. I don't know if I'm ever having any PSA 10s, but I'm going to have some PSA fun. <laughs> that's a holo. Next we have, ooh, uh, Reverse Hollow Spiro. We don't save the best for last on this channel. How many attempts can a perfectionist take? These are their stories. Dun dun. We're trying something different. I have a Nikon D5100 DSLR, my iPhone 11 Pro Max. I'm trying to have two cameras so you can get some facial reactions. That's the word. And then also you can see the cards better. I realized the other episodes it was a little, uh, eh. Quick story. Now Target is only allowing you to get one at a time. I went with my fiance, we each got one. We went to self-checkout, I believe Saturday or Sunday. Monday, I went to go check Target out to see basically what they had. And I picked another one up. So I got three of them. I saw that, cause I was a little out of the loop, that they are doing Fridays at 8 a.m. It's when they're doing the trainer boxes. So I'm gonna set an early alarm to get up for that. I usually get up around seven. I might get up a little earlier. And then I went tonight to get a memory card for this camera that's up there. Let's see, it's a little setup. <laughs> they have one of these bad boys. You can kind of see that there may be a little bend in there. A hollow Jolteon, I was like, okay. There is a bad glare right there that is the plastic. It's not that damaged. So we got three of the single ones. And this, I guess, with tax, you get more cards. I guess it's a little less, excuse me. And then you get, I guess, a couple extra cards. So we're gonna leave that for last. My fiance picked out which ones to pick. Um, this is, I forget your name, Emporion? Emporion. It's the guy that was the little, you know, the, the little guy. <laughs> you know, the little guy. So these are the ones that didn't work last time. We do have these deck protectors, KMC. Doing me right, doing us all right. We double sleeve on this channel, just a friendly reminder. And then the KMC Perfect Sleeves. I might have to buy some more. I didn't know how many cards I was gonna get. I thought it was gonna be almost impossible to get some. We're gonna place those to the side. Let's open up this booster. I don't have a specific way I open them. I just try to be really careful. I'm also trying to like look around my camera. Nope. Okay, so the cards always open up that way. I'm not sharing the card codes because I don't even know much about them, but maybe I will. We're gonna start off with Trainer Mustard. I might have had him last time and forgot. So cool. There's that. Okay, Durant. Kevin Durant in the house. Did not have this one previously. I was a little upset it did nothing in Pokemon Go and that it was just single evolution. And I don't know. The single evolution guys in Pokemon Go are kind of boring. It's like, why are you there? Okay, dark type. Wait, is that? Oh, more Pekka. That's Pikachu. Stop lying. That's Pikachu. Just look. It's like gothic Pikachu. I do like this dark card. It's cool. It does kind of make me have a small panic attack. Like, what does that mean? Because I'm still trying to figure out how good these cards are and what to know. Energy. Okay. I don't think I have that one yet. Is this going to be good? Ooh, that one's a little shipped. Not a PSA 10. Claydol. I had Ball Toy, so now I got Ball Toy and Claydol. So that's good. Got a combo. Uh, oh, Reverse Hollow. Gliscor. I just had the normal one last time. Nice. Nice. There's two cameras. I don't know where to look. We're trying to get all the emotions in this day. Um, let's see. Spiro. This is my third Spiro. It's okay. It is what it is. You know, it's like playing Pokemon Go. You're going to see some similar ones. Yeah. Onyx, oh, sleeping Onyx, that's pretty cute. I thought I'm talking to my dog. Oh, aren't you cute? All right, that's nice. Um, let's see, any hollow, any hollow, Bellsprout, okay. So I have a reverse hollow. I wonder if I'm gonna get anything special. Mr. Mime, okay, I don't have Galarian Mr. Mime, nice. And then last but not least is, I don't even know you, Mienfo, he's stretching. It's kind of cool, I like that. A little stretchy stretch. So really we just got that reverse hollow Gliscor over here. I'm gonna at least leave that one real quick. Now you guys can actually see what I was doing. Make sure you have clean hands. I would just wash your hands. You don't have to do gloves or anything. You don't have to go crazy. The first sleeve is always really easy. It's the perfect sleeve for a reason. I like these KMC ones because they're a little thinner. So if you're like me and you like double insurance, <laughs> You'll have both. It can fit in another one. That's what I'm trying to say. I'm gonna try and do it through the camera. There we go. 
And you know it's a good deck protector when you get it in there and there isn't a lot of extra that comes out right there. See how it stayed? That's just a little fuzz. There's a lot of fuzz. Attack of the fuzz. It's it's at the end. That's all you need to know. You just wanted to give it center. So okay, cool. Reverse hollow. Pretty sweet. I just like the artwork. We'll sleeve these later. So let's just open. So let's see what we have first. Trainer level ball. I'm trying not to stack these because actually I do care about each individual card. I'll probably get less and less uh, delicate the more I get into this. Ooh, that's just a regular Pokemon. Okay. <laughs> Buffalant. Buffalant. It's like a Tauros. Okay, we got Tauros copycat. I don't even know some of these. All right, Bruckish. Okay, that looks, looks like that would be in Shark Tale. That's what that looks like. Energy. Energy, energy, energy. I always get hungry doing these videos. I don't know why. Oh, that is, I don't even know what these cards are called. VMAX. Okay, Mimikyu. Creepy. Dummy doll ability. Okay, jealous eyes. I like that. Is it in good shape? Yeah, I mean, there's a little bit up there. I'll probably go into like a card shop and be like, hey, What's this guy worth? Not every single one. Oh, reverse hollow cack turn. Okay, this was a better pull. I like literally pull. Can we zoom in on pull? We're gonna learn how to edit. We don't even know how to edit yet. <laughs> we we're a family here. Bell Sprout. Okay, we just saw you. I think that's the first time I got two of the same ones in the same day, and I've had some doubles. Okay, sailing it, solid it. Okay, that, that works. You work. You're a Pokemon. Do I have a trainer card coming up? Murkrow. I think I have Murkrow, but Murkrow's pretty cool. Uh, let's see. Yamper. A little Corgi. And it's got a little Pokeball in there. That's pretty cute. Okay, and then we're gonna finish it off with Slowpoke. Okay, nice. I'm losing some space. So I'm gonna sleeve these. We'll come back. Sweet. 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 I'm gonna take a water break. Me a little girl. Are you happy? you see yourself? Boop. He's cute. I really hope this video turns out well. Celtics just lost, it was a little sad. I feel like I just played a game or something. I don't know, I'm so thirsty. The last salty food today. I was playing Suns, Lakers, close game. 6-9, damn she fine. Lakers just scored AD healthy. LeBron playing yet? Mm, who cares? Haterade. Um, So I'm gonna sleep these. Let's do this shiny baby. We're gonna do both cameras on this one. That's probably the second coolest card I've pulled. That Tyranitar was sweet. Then the, it goes from the top. From the top! <laughs> We try to be family friendly here, but. Ooh, rip. Well, that's a good deck. A good deck protector. That was smooth. What's the next coolest card? The Cacturn. Ayo, ballerific. It's all right, we'll get a team. We'll get some sponsors. Maybe I'll get like an intern that's better at sleeving than me. I have a lot of fun doing this. I have to look around the camera though. That's backwards. You can't see the card. I like when YouTubers put their setup out and then they're just like, yeah, this is what I do. I think those are the best content creators out there. Basically just say, yeah, this is everything I use. Go get it. Like I literally got this binder. I got the perfect sleeves and then deck protectors. I don't know. Still learn how you call it. But I just Googled, you know, how to protect your cards, you know, binders, sleeves, all that jazz. TV's on. I like the idea of a TV being on for some reason. I always had a TV on as a kid. Saturday morning cartoons, anyone? I think I was born on a Saturday at like 10, 10 a.m. Like around Saturday morning cartoons. I wonder if that's a sign. I also wonder if when you're born is when you can, when you wake up. <laughs> Cause I know on the weekends when I don't, stay up late or when i do stay up late 10 o'clock is good for me i'm just like okay okay i can do that i like this sleep that's why having a desk job it kind of stinks if you get creative at night then guess what you're either gonna be super tired and then you're gonna hate yourself you sleep in more you get to late late worker to work later and then you gotta stay later it's like this vicious cycle i'm trying to balance out like it's a wednesday it's about 9 30 trying to really balance out recording this daytime nighttime music that's another channel of mine content is kind of you no know, it really has slacked but 
Working on the craft, no. I've been rapping since I was 11. I love the art form. I just love the raw creativity, the expression. It's just always been there for me. A lot of people say like, rap saved my life. It did for me. It was just always there for me. It was always something that I could rely on. I love the wittiness, creativity. The same line can be said by 10 different MCs and it just sounds 10 different ways, you know? It's just crazy. It's like, we all have a story and we're all just trying to tell it, i.e. YouTube. Is that the phrase I use? As you can tell, we're not perfect on this channel. This is Mike's Likes, but it should be called like medium Mike's Likes or like average Mike's Likes. I'm just an average guy. I'm just really here to put out some content and be happy. Whether I get five views or five million views, doesn't matter to me. I mean, it would be nice to get five million views. Thousand views a video, right? Just be happy, you know? All right, let's go, Kevin Durant. He gets a lot of hate. I get it. Going to the Warriors wasn't the best move, but the man won rings, and you'll remember him forever because of that. If he did it, he would just be another one of these guys that scored a lot of points, was in the playoffs a lot, and that's it. It's this balance. We say, like, oh, don't ring chase or don't go to this team or that team. I'm a Celtics fan. Grew up, St. Louis didn't have teams. You know, you like players and Kevin, uh, Kevin Durant. Kevin Garnett, big ticket. You know, he's on backyard basketball and intensity. I like the guy. I was just like, he was in Minnesota for a while. When a guy's on a team for a while, you gotta, you know, let your feelings, let those go to the side. At the end of the day, these guys are playing their hearts out. They just wanna win a ring. Championships really do matter. Money's cool, but come on. You were able to say I was an NBA champion. All right, back to Pokemon. I'm having a good time. Look how much that slide. That is nice. That's what I paid premium price for. Oh, shiitake mushrooms. I don't think any of these were really that expensive. It's sharp. It's a plastic, so it's not like it's cloth. I wonder if they make like bougie ones. They do feel nice. The double sleeve is cool. I feel like these will last. I don't know if it means like five years longer or what it might be, but it lasts longer and that's cool. So we're just gonna basic sleeve these onyx don't want to get water on onyx i can't believe we still have more cards to open it's crazy i'll see on face was it facebook marketplace i think amazon does it too people are just selling buckets of these because i'm betting they just buy a bunch of booster packs they complete their collection and then they'll get extras of some hollows reverse hollows and they'll say okay if i have extras i'll give what a couple hundred maybe normal cards or common cards they're just dumping off those other ones and i'm like that's a lot of cards. I don't know if I've hit 10 boosters yet. And that's what, that's 100 cards. I like this Galarian Mr. Mine, that's cool. Mr. Mine is always an interesting character. Okay, so we got the basic sleeve on all the, oh, no, there's more over here. Bell Sprout. Bell, 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 Bell. I think I, when I was first collecting cards, I had like a first edition Bell Sprout, and I, I was like, this is cool, because it's grass, and grass is real. So this Pokemon could be real. There could be one in my backyard. There wasn't one. Horse, slow poke. I think why the Pokemon card game is probably really fun because the value of these cards, meaning when you play with them, if you play Pokemon Go, there are some Pokemon that are literally worthless. You might care if it's a hundo, meaning 100% IV. You might care if it's shiny. Some shinies are really cool. And then that's it, <laughs> you know? The 100%, the shiny, shundo is what people call it. But some Pokemon, you wait till the evolution comes out in a later generation, like Murkrow's not much, but Honchkrow. I think it's good. I don't know if it's PvP or is a dark type attacker. Then you play like the main games, the video games, and it's like Pidgey is doing work in the first, you know, beginnings of the game. The more you get into the game, it's like Pidgeotto, Pidgeot, Pidgeot, Pidgeotto. Pretend I got those in the right order. You're just like, oh, okay. You know, Gust, Sand Attack. And then you get into here. I don't have an example, but I imagine it gets better. <laughs> Somewhat, I mean, there's strategy. I don't know if I've ever even even played the trading card game. I think it may be not as popular for the older you get because the older you get, the more you're on your own with stuff. You have other responsibilities besides uh, collecting trading cards. These deck protectors though, these are smooth. I'm having a good time tonight. Sober Sam. I remember who was it? And my friends, they had a guy they knew. Call him Sober Tony. I never learned why. I don't know if it was like when he was sober, he was completely different. And then when they all would have a couple of drinks, it was like Johnny Knoxville or something. But I just remember they would call him Sober Tony. Or maybe he was just sober all the time and we were all jerks. I only would repeat it, you know. I was just following orders. That's never sound bad. If we get these last two in. You know what, Level Ball, you're second to last because Onyx is really cool. Just imagine how 
terrified you would be if an onyx was just like in the way. You're like, oh, hi, giant boulder on top of boulder. On top of boulder, rock snake. That's a hard snake. Ew. <laughs>